Hi friends, welcome back. In this video, we will start learning about the anchor element. So, here we have our text editor, and I have already set up very basic web page here. Let's go ahead and create what's called an anchor tag. So, to do that, we will just type a and put inside of two anchor brackets, just like that. And this is how we actually create links on web pages. And now I now here we are going to use a new attribute called href attribute or hyperlink reference we are going to give this the value hash sign and then equal in the quotes page inside of anchor tag so between these two tags i am just going to go ahead and type link to paragraph and let's add some space so I am going to create a few break tags here. And we will just copy and paste the, these lines for a few times. This is only for practice but having this many BR tag is not normal. The reason we are creating all of these is just to space another element further down the page which will which we will add in just a second now normally an element thus further down the page would simply be pushed down by the other content so let's go ahead and and add in a paragraph here and here we all just say the anchor will comes here now we are going to introduce another new attribute here called the id attribute so we will add that to our paragraph tag and we will give it it the value page which is exactly same as the href of our anchor tag the id attribute identifies an element it allows you to select a specific element so we will go ahead and save our save out that and switch back to our browser and refresh and now if we scroll down the page here down and bottom we have the text the anchor takes us here so if we scroll back up and click this link it takes down to the anchor now let's go ahead and switch back and let's actually add some space below that to paragraph switch back and try it again so so when we click the link it brings us to the paragraph and and the thing that you would should notice is that it brings us to the top of the element and scroll again to up we click the link and it brings us down to the paragraph but what if we want to get up back to the top we have to scroll back up which is not good experience for user we should really add a way to for for user get back up there themselves without having to scroll Similarly, you should avoid forcing the user to use the back button. You should always provide a way for the user to get back from within your website. So let's go ahead and fix this. To do that, we, we will add another link below here of here our paragraph here. We will say go back. and we need to hook up this link to the anchor up here so let's go ahead and fill this in with href equal inside quotes hash go up and up here we will give it the same id of up underscore here we will save that out switch back switch back to browser and refresh and now we can click this link it's it will bring us down here page to the paragraph and we can click this other anchor tag and it will bring us to the back up to the top so we will try that one more time click the brings down here and click again and it brings up to the top the anchor element can do more than just like together single parts of the page it can also link together separate HTML pages formatting the foundation of a website 
सो गाइस थैंक्स फॉर वाचिंग एंड प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल